Hi everyone, it's Michelle and welcome to my channel, Kansas Girl of 1969. Well, I've got a short and sweet video for you today. I have another new curiosity that I'm checking out and it happens to be a bath and shower type of line. And so I thought you might enjoy seeing what I've tried and then please let me know in the comments below if you've tried any of these or if there's any other scents that in the same line that you've tried that I haven't and that you think maybe I would like. Well, I was watching Peg and her channel is Sheba Lifts. I will put her picture and channel name up in here somewhere. She was talking a few weeks ago about some things that she got at Ulta and a couple of those things were Shea Moisture brand things that go in the shower. So I wanted to try some too because I was already in the market for getting some new things for my shower and thought, hmm, maybe if she thinks they're pretty good and she's tried them before, maybe I would like them also. And you know, with it being colder outside these days, I've been feeling like my skin's a little bit drier and the Shea Moisture line has Shea Butter and other oils in it, so I thought that might be really good for the skin. So of course, the first thing I went straight for was this coffee scrub, this body scrub. And here is what it looks like. The Rebound and Revive Coffee Scrub with Black Current and Barrage Oils for stressed skin. I don't know that my skin is stressed, but myself, this girl, is stressed. So I thought, whatever. I didn't care what it said about it. I just like the fact that it said it was coffee. Let me show you. This is a 12-ounce jar, so it's really big. And it actually has these coffee grounds in it. Is that not amazing? And... The scent. If you like coffee, it is absolutely fabulous. It's coffee. The only drawback that I have with this is, let me show you, it's literally coffee grounds and you scrub it all over your body and it does make your body very soft. Your skin feels really soft. The only problem is this is this dark black grain that gets all over the shower is some of it does go down the drain instantly and some of it for me anyway kind of gets sprayed out to the sides of the floor of my shower and I have a tile shower and, and the bottom is made out of little stones with grout in between so the bottom of my shower is very bumpy anyway I get those little black grains all over the place and then in the shower itself I don't have a handheld nozzle where I could you know go in with something and spray and try to get all the grains to go down the drain. Instead, all we have is this rain head that just shoots water straight down. So I can't direct the water any different direction. So it makes it a little bit difficult because if you don't want to have grains all over the bottom of your shower, or I should say coffee grounds all over the bottom of your shower, if you have a shower like mine, it takes a little more effort maybe get a bucket of water to slosh in there to get those coffee grounds down the drain. Now, if you have just a, a plexiglass shower or something that's a molded, a clear, plastic, is what I'm trying to say, shower, then I think you'd be okay because it would be much easier to, to direct those coffee grounds down the drain. But that's my only drawback to this type of scrub. But man, does it ever smell fabulous. And it says that it's coffee and cherry. I don't smell much cherry at all. I smell almost totally coffee, but to me it's perfectly fine because that smells delicious. Now, it was buy two, get one free at Ulta, and so I went ahead and picked up a couple other things, and I hadn't tried their bar soap. So this is what the bar soap looks like after having been used a few times. And I bought this little container, this soap dish at Target for $1.99, I think. But anyway, the this bar is also the coffee and cherry, and it smells a little bit like coffee, I guess it's a little bit like cherry and sweet. It smells really good. It's got the little bitty coffee grounds down in it also, and it's very moisturizing and it smells yummy. And then I, the third item that I got is another bar of soap and it's called Fruit Fusion Coconut Water Energizing Shea Butter Soap. And this is how the soaps come. They're, they're wrapped up in a little piece of plastic and this smells fabulous. A little fruity, a little coconutty, maybe a little vanilla. It's something sweet. It smells really good, but I won't be using it until I'm done with the other bar of soap. And I'll say that these Shea Butter Bars, they really do lather up very nicely. I'm able to shave my legs using that, and it's really nice. So far, so good. I am actually liking that quite a bit. So that's what I got. That's my new curiosity. Have you ever tried this line before? 
Um, I do have something that I got. I think it was a free with purchase, or maybe I added it on to a purchase to get free shipping. And it's by Shea Moisture, and it's a Curl and Shine Shampoo. I have this, but I have never used it yet, so I don't know if I like it. Let me know if you have some items out of this line that you really like, or some scents that you really like that I haven't tried. Just I'm curious to see what's out there and what people have liked. Well, thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you guys all have a wonderful week, and I will talk to you again really soon. Bye!